Greetings, good people. I know you can scarce believe your eyes, but tis I, Robin Hood, official outlaw of Nottingham Town. I'm here on my daily perambulation and I thought I'd bring you guys some good news. The future looks exciting for Nottingham. On top of the Castle Rock here, look, the scaffolding which has been covering the castle for the last few years has been taken off and once again the castle is looking over the city from its vantage point on this great rock. Now on previous posts I've mentioned that Nottingham is going through a massive £2 billion regeneration. Well Nottingham Castle itself is going through a £30 million refurbishment and when it opens in 2021 it will be the crowning glory of Nottingham's renaissance. Some people who come to Nottingham are surprised by Nottingham Castle's appearance because it doesn't look like a castle. But I'll tell you one thing, Nottingham Castle has got one of the most fascinating stories of any castle here in England. In the days of Robin Hood, this was a super castle. It was the main royal residence in the Midlands in the early medieval period. It had battlements and towers and turrets reaching up into the sky. In 1642, Charles I declared war on Parliament here and in doing so started the first civil war in the Western world. As a result of the civil war in the 1650s during the Republic, the parliamentarians had to pull down the castle because it was such an important castle and they couldn't have it being used against them by the royalists as a stronghold again. In the 1670s, the Duke of Newcastle, who had been gifted this land on the restoration, built his own Renaissance-style palace on top of the rock where the castle used to be. But in 1831, the people of Nottingham set fire to the Duke's palace during the Reform Bill riots. Now this is central to the national story of the right to vote in this country. For nearly 50 years, it lay a burnt out shell on top of the rock. In the 1870s, the town council with a V and A in London turned the charred hulk of a building into the first municipal museum and art gallery outside of London. When Nottingham Castle reopens in 2021, visitors will be able to discover a thousand years of history and explore tales of power, protest and rebellion, and of course a legend of Robin Hood through its brand new interactive experiences, tours, exhibitions and collections. It will be the crowning glory of Nottingham's Renaissance. And so, good people of the world, when lockdown is over, come and join us here in historic Nottingham as it evolves into the city of the future. In the meantime, stay safe, spread the peace, Robin Hood lives.